Alright fellas, and welcome back to episode 5 of Full Throttle, the post-endgame Avengers episode of Full Throttle. I just saw that movie uh, with the wife and whatnot. It was pretty awesome. I, I do admit the job they did was awesome. Cool. What are we gonna do? We're back here with Ben Throttle. We're at the Corley Motors the Factory. Corley Motors Factory. Holy ground. Holy ground. No. Uh, hmm. No. No. <laughs> uh, let's go in here. Corley Motors. Big door. <laughs> That's one big door. Just like the cell doors in solitary. I'm here for the shareholders meeting. Mr. Ripperger has postponed the meeting until Mr. Corley's murderers are apprehended. All the shareholders were notified. Yeah. Well, I haven't checked my voicemail lately, Mac. <laughs> voicemail? Sheesh. No. Let me in. Beat it. Jerk. <laughs> wow. Let me in. Beat it. Jerk. Hmm. Well, we knew it wasn't going to be as simple as walking in the front door. Alright, guys. Sorry for that little, uh, thing. Ooh. Wizards of Legend, version 1.4. Hope that's one that tells you what the items do. We'll do a playthrough of that soon. But, uh, yeah, Kohler Motors didn't think it was going to be just that easy to go to the front door, of course. Souvenirs here! We got your hats. <laughs> we got your pennants. We got it all right here. Official Corley Motors merchandise. Drive your own derby car by remote control. Our bunnies come with batteries included. Lovable, lovable. <clears throat> what can I get you? Why are all the lights down here? We got a demolition derby tonight. First prize is a vintage Corley hardtail, completely restored by the old man himself. Yep. Okay. What's this big arena doing way out here? Corley built the Smashatorium so his employees could have some wholesome entertainment nearby. He sure took care of his employees. I got no idea what's gonna happen to us now that he's gone. <laughs> I'm looking for a good souvenir. Well, good souvenirs is all I got. What can I fix you up with? Uh... How about that little car there? It's small, but it's not cheap, my friend. You better just take it for a test drive to make sure. <laughs> for sure. Those uh, shirts come in extra, extra large. Eh. Eh, no. But they're pretty shrunk. No thanks. What do those pennants say on them? Can't beat a Corley, they say. Kind of ironic, actually, considering how he died. <laughs> Still, look great on your bedroom wall. No walls. My bike is my home. We could set you up with a little pole so you could uh, make a flag, you know, for your back seat. I don't know. Think about it. Something small, furry, and yellow. Something small, furry, and yellow. Sorry, this is the only set of teeth I got. <laughs> Dang, there goes another one. Ugh. Bunnies, and plenty of them. You want bunnies? I got your bunnies. <laughs> How much you got on you? Um. Can I just take them out for a test drive? I think you may not be ready for the kind of commitment that comes with a Corley Bunny value pack. Sorry, son. <laughs> Do you actually have any money? As much as I need. Seen any vultures around here? Nah, we don't have much of a vulture problem here, even though their hideout is right up the road. They <laughs> stay pretty much locked up in there. Not very social. Came to their hideout What's like that? that. I don't know. Came filled with it. <laughs> Probably some sort of packing material. Packs a punch, I'll tell you that much. Packs a punch? It's a kind of Looky packing here. material. Nothing personal, but why don't you mosey along and stop scaring away all the other customers, all right? Just clearing my throat. Other customers. We well, got your t-shirts here. All sizes and colors. Fill our handy beverage hats with your drink of choice. What's this here? Turnstile? It's the exit. It only spins one way, and it's the wrong way. <laughs> oh, that doesn't tell you everything you need to know. Sheesh. 
That's the old hardtail Mo restored with Malcolm. Hmm. Uh, you big fella, come give our derby car a spin. Souvenirs to remind you of your special Smashatorium adventure. Another hit to tell Buy you basically what you need so to do. they'll shut up on the long drive home. Don't be a cheap jerk. Buy something. <laughs> All right. So let us. If we do don't that. got it, then it stinks. <laughs> sure, sure. Take it for a spin. Just don't go out of range. Just don't go out of range. All right. Pat the bunny. You know you want to. You just can't get this stuff anywhere else, folks. And it's cheap, too. <laughs> I'm practically giving this loot away. What's a couple of bucks in exchange for a timeless memento? Looks like it's getting weak. Oh, great. You killed the batteries. These souvenirs all have an expected appreciation rate of 300% per year. It's a joystick. Probably for that little car. <laughs> Don't crowd it. No. Uh, so you could work this thing? What the? It's out of juice. That's right. Official Corley Motors Smashatorium Souvenirs. Kind of cute. For a car, that is. Hmm. It's out of juice. Don't go away empty-handed. Come on, give me a break. <laughs> out of juice. Where we at here? Yeah, the uh, vultures have a... Next to the Corley Motors factory, which is kind of weird. They have this hideout to... Uh, right here? I don't walk. I don't walk. Where's the bike, then? <sighs> Sheesh. Ah, get on the bike. Nani? Fires threat protection. Ah, there we go. There's the vulture's hideout. On the other side of this field, this I've heard a lot about the vultures. And I guess it's all true. Okay, well, we don't mm. want to walk out there. No. What happens? Will he, will he even walk out there? I don't want to set off any of these boys. Those <laughs> weapons were a lot of weight. I'd like to wrap this around Rip Burger's neck. Huh. This chain could never handle my horsepower. Okay. Got a chain and a tire iron. Hmm. Let's see here. I think I remember what to do here. I haven't been that long. Not too many options. The game does a good job of kind of keeping it down, so you don't like. There's another game that I like a lot called uh, Thimbleweed Park. That one you can solve like almost every puzzle in the game from the start of the game, which makes it really hard because you're working on like maybe eight puzzles at once, and uh, that definitely makes it tough. No. If we don't got it, then it stinks. Let's see, <laughs> charge this thing back up. Out of juice. Let's talk to this guy. We got it all right there. here. Charge it back up for us. That's right. A fish. <clears throat> Looky here. Nothing personal. But why don't you mosey along and stop scaring away all the other customers? All right. Just clearing my throat. Ain't no other customers here. Drive your own derby car by. It's meant for nuts. All sizes and. I'm saving that chain for my friends on the old mine road. Don't go away empty-handed. All right. Let's see the cash, amigo. I'll owe you. No bucks, no yucks, compadre. Hallelujah. <laughs> we got your t shirt uh, in. Souvenirs I here. Get this thing charged back up, because I think you have to drive it over to the other thing, right? Uh, batteries. Charge. It's out of juice. We got it all right here. Don't mm. be a cheap jerk. Buy something. Well, 
I guess it was inevitable that we would get stuck at some point. In the old adventure game. Let us wander yeah, in there. They all think I killed their beloved leader. I'm saving that chain for money. It's meant for nuts. It's meant for nuts. <laughs> uh, hmm. Well, and see. A chain too. What do we do here? Come on, give me a break. Official Carla Motors merchandise. Uh, that wouldn't help things. That's right. No. All sizes and colors. It's a joystick. Probably for that little car. Lovable, lovable little bunnies. Kinda cute. The officially licensed bunny of the Corley Motors Smashatorium. I'm not putting my lips on that. Don't crowd everybody. There's enough for... Ah. We got your hat. No. Uh. Hmm. You just can't get this stuff anywhere else, folks. Fill our handy beverage Let's hat see. with your drink of choice. I can remember that we need to get him away so we can grab the bunny box. That's the stadium. There's not really too many places to go, that's for sure. Uh, nothing you can do around here, that's for sure. Let's see. Hmm. Is there a, oh, what's this here? Aha! It doesn't help. <laughs> Hatch. It's sealed shut. It's sealed shut. It's sealed shut. Yeah, yeah. Hatch. It's closed. I'll beat it up later when I have more time. I'll beat up the wall later. Eaters. Wow, this place sucks up the juice. Hmm. 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 <laughs> Let's see. What are we gonna do here? I thought that you had to do something with that guy. Let's go back to that souvenir guy. I'm, I'm sure that there's something there. Drive your own derby car by remote control. Uh, come on. This has got juice. out of juice. Come on, Let's give me a break. We got your pennants. Saving that for his friends. I'm saving that chain for my friends on the old mine road. Come on, give me a break. Don't be a cheap jerk. Mm. Buy something. Mm. I got a button under my toe that's wired directly into Corley Security's alarm system. Of course, I could be lying, but the question is, do you feel lucky? Lately? No. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Looky here, but why don't you just click? Okay, so he doesn't want anything. If we don't uh... got it, then it stinks. <laughs> Ask about this. Fill our handy beverage hats with your. I'm not putting my lips on that. Ask about it. Excuse me, but are those shirts, uh, are they all cotton? Well, uh, let's just see here. Give me that. While he's looking. 100% cotton. Oh. Uh, that's too bad. I'm allergic to cotton. <laughs> ah, the old Don't adventure crowd, game. Tiny for train. everyone. We well, you got your t shirt it's, uh, That's another. Fill old handy beverage hats game. with your drink of choice. It's, uh, you only had a certain window of time to, uh, to do something like while a character's in an animation. Get on that bike. Now we have the bunny. And now the bunny can identify the mines. The minefield's been replanted. Tidy little vultures. Wow. Yeah. Ack. Ack. Make it! <laughs> eh? 
What's that now? Ah, battery. Power Blast brand. How ironic. Power Blast. Okay, that's what we needed. That's how you get through that. Now we got the battery. Now we can get the RC car going again, which will enable us to... Get the rest of the bunnies. There's like a bunny box behind that guy. I'll tell you, for a biker that's got to spend a lot of time on a bike. Well, the last section we were on the bike almost the whole time, so I think it's probably they probably did a good enough Don't job go away empty-handed. Don't crowd everybody. There's enough for everyone. Let's see. Put that in that. No. Put that Souvenirs in here. That. that should put some life into it. Sure, sure. Take it for a spin. Just there don't go. go out of range. Now, I'm practically giving this loot away. Go over here. You just can't get this stuff anywhere else, folks. And then we can drive it into there. Hey, don't go in there. <laughs> now look what you did. The entrance is all the way through the factory. Hang on, little buddy. Daddy's coming. Now it's just me and the bunnies. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I love his look as he grabs that, like, <sighs> crap, unashamed. No mementos. I'll have scars enough to remind me of this trip. No mementos. Out of range. Nope, not as much fun without the car. <laughs> Alright, let's get out of here. Get on that bike. I don't walk. Oh, what are you doing? Who told you to get off the bike? There we go. Ooh. The old pop of the neck there. So, bunnies, open. It's a whole box of those furry things. Open them. It's a whole box of those furry things. Uh, 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 you don't have to do them all at once, right? Maybe. That works? Hold on, wait a minute. Yeah, that's it. You had to pick them up, otherwise, uh, you just lose them. I hate surprises. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. There we go. Yeah, you gotta, uh, you gotta pick them up, otherwise, I'll just blow up all at once. So walk. No. As far as you can walk. And then, uh, yeah, just uh, do one bunny at a time. Another one. Sheesh. Walk forward a little bit. Yeah. Uh, the reason I'm so insistent on walking forward because I've done this before where. He won't, uh. No. No. He won't walk, uh, up to the point that you need him to walk to. No. No. Go. There you go.
go. Close enough. And then uh, you have to do like the whole little bunny puzzle all over again. It's one thing with these adventure games, sometimes they have a little bit like the controls are a little bit awkward or stiff. down and scroll it so I can yeah he'll walk as far as he can so. should be anyway there you go oh you only needed a couple that's the guy I was telling you about Susie you sure yeah that's the guy who killed my father whoa, all whoa, right whoa. vultures rack them up Let's rip him quick. Listen, Mo, you're making a big mistake. Oh, Ben, you're right. We shouldn't do this quickly. We should draw this out, don't you think, Susie? Hey, I got all night. You heard her, kids. Let's draw this out. <laughs> ah! Corley and I... Don't you dare talk about my father, you heartless bastard! <laughs> you could try this, but uh, it's not gonna work. Your father. I said, shut up about my dad. So you have to go down this. It's a, this is a dialogue tree puzzle. Here we go. Let me go, or else. Or else what? <laughs> now, I remember I did this the first time by complete accident, but. We'll just, uh... <laughs> I'll show you what happens if you feel it. get blood all over your driveway. That's good for the landscaping, actually. Let me Let go, go, or else... Or else what? I'll call your names. <laughs> like what? Ah, okay, guys. What do you think is the correct one here? It's a good time to pause and, uh... Which one is the one that's, uh... The, uh, the one that's going to progress us further down the track. You might remember, the hit is earlier in the dialogue. <laughs> I actually picked this one first time again, but it was by mistake. I was actually trying to see all the different dialogue options. I wanted to just go on down the right path. It's this one. Diaper Dynamo. How did you hear that name? Your father. He told me just before he died. You bludgeoned my father and then talked about old times? I didn't kill him. Rip Burger did. A photographer took pictures, but her camera was stolen by the same thug that came after you. I, I still have that role. Well, develop it, would you? While I still fit in my clothes? Okay, you stay here. Hey. <laughs> Didn't develop Sorry. that role? <laughs> yeah, well, don't sweat it. I'm gonna get Rip Burger even if I die trying. No, we have to expose Rip Burger at the shareholders' meeting. That way, we take him down, we save my gang, and your father gets his dying wish. You take over Corley Motors. Rip Burger canceled the shareholders' meeting. He made a statement to the press that there'd be no meeting until the murderers were brought to justice. So. No shareholders meeting until we're both dead? Hmm. That could be arranged. <laughs> okay, so here we go. Faking Ben and Maureen's death. Act one, scene one. Adrian Ripburger, in a desperate attempt to lure our Maureen out of hiding, has developed the following lame-ass scheme. <laughs> First prize of tonight's smash-up derby is a vintage hard tail that Mo restored with her dad. Rip hopes Mo will try to nab said bike on account of her sentimental attachment to it. So Ben and Mo play along, put on disguises, and enter the demolition derby, which ends tragically when their cars explode and both are presumed dead. Uh, question. Please save your questions until the end. Now, the explosives in Mo's car can only be triggered by a head-on collision with Ben's car. This ejector seat projects Mo clear of the explosion, and she parachutes to safety. 
don't you think someone will notice her rejecting out of her car? No, they'll all be watching you running around on fire. Yeah, that's another question I have. When your car <laughs> explodes, you climb from it in flames and run around the stadium distracting the audience. In your cute little asbestos suit, of course. <laughs> that's some plan. All right, then. Let's go blow your little darlings up. All right, folks. Hang on to your chili dogs, because it's time to start. The Corley Motor Smashatorium Amateur Driver Ultimate Destruction Maximum Carnage Marathon. Maximum Let's Carnage. Gladiators. That mysterious looking hooded figure wouldn't give us his real name. He prefers to be known as the Unknown Avenger. And that's just fine with us, isn't it, folks? Blue guy? Mo in an obvious <laughs> wig. Now I'm just embarrassed for them. Who do they think they're fooling with those ludicrous disguises? And next to him is another masked newcomer. Please give a big smashatorium salute to the princess of Pile-Up, Dory Schmorley. Schmorley? Come on. All right, boys. Sick of me. And finally, we have a last-minute addition to the lineup tonight. A deadly-looking team known as the Boom Boom Brothers. Are you ready to see some reckless driving? <laughs> Are you ready to see some unnecessarily violent destruction? <laughs> then let the demolition derby begin! Where are you, Ben? Hang on, Mo. Here I come. This is another action segment where you, uh... Uh, control the car and try and drive into her stop the explosion but no matter what happens watch out for the boom boom brothers mo guys always here the situation but we will deal with that on the next episode of full throttle hope you guys are enjoying watching so far and leave a comment or some feedback if you are, and let me know. So, either way, hope you enjoyed that, and we'll see you next time. See you guys.